Uh, hello everyone, my name is Arsene Baktiktaş. Uh, I'm taking EE 102 course, um, Introduction to Digital uh, Circuit Design in Bilkent University. Um, and um, this is my uh, final project, uh, term project. Um, I, will, uh, I have to use base 3 and uh, I have to uh, program it with the uh, HDF, the language. Um, so, in my project, um, it's a term uh, with base 3. Um, so, it's basically um, measuring two distances. Uh, one for um, determining the nodes and the uh, other for uh, determining the octets of the uh, nodes. Um, so for a, uh, a short demo, for example, it's like stall and it's rare, it's smooth, it's far, it's soft. Star and C. So, as you see, um, there are seven nodes, and for different octaves, for example, there are different nodes. Like this one. Um, in each octave, actually, I, I'm doubling the frequency because the nodes are. I mean, the octaves are defined like this one. And um, I measure two different distances, then map, uh, map them to the uh, nodes um, and uh, octaves, actually, um, because uh, this one determines the octaves. Um, and after mapping, um, I, I generate uh, discrete signals. And, uh, and these, uh, these signals, uh, with certain frequencies um, generates the nodes. Um, so the main principle of the uh, main working principle of uh, distance sensor is like um, I am sending a trigger uh, signal from basis to um, distance sensor in order to uh, make sensor work. And then sensor uh, sends a pull signal to the object. Like for example, my hand, uh, and then um, this full signal um, goes back to the um, distance sensor. Uh, when distance sensor receives back the signal, a full signal, um, it may measures the time between um, the the time uh, when it sends the uh, full signal and it receives, uh, and um, according to that time, uh, it determines the uh, distance uh, by some calculations. Um, so, for another demo, for example. Like this one. And I also showed the uh, distances in um, seven segments so that the user uh, could have more control on uh, on the mode. Um, so that's all.